Hello everyone, myself P. Jitender, Assistant Professor in Electrical and Electronics Engineering, MLR Institute of Technology. So in today's session, we are going to I am going to discuss about the transient analysis of series or C circuit. Okay. So here, so we have to discuss the transient analysis of series or C circuit. So in this series or C circuit, so we have to calculate the the current response of RC circuit and voltage drop across the resistor and voltage drop across the capacitor with differential equation. Okay. So here, here I am taking the series RC circuit. So here I am taking the one series RC circuit, resistor and capacitor and voltage is V plus minus voltage is V and here we are having the switch S and resistor R and capacitor is C. So initially if T equal to 0 then I also 0. So I equal to 0. Now if switch is closed the electrical current is directly passes through the resistor and capacitor. So it is a series it is a series circuit in series circuit current is constant right. But we are having the different voltage drops at resistor R at capacitor at capacitor C. So at resistor R voltage drop is Vr at capacitor voltage drop is Vc. Right. So now write the voltage equation of the resistor. So at R Vr equal to I into R at C Vc equal to voltage equation 1 by C integral of I dt. Okay. So, here take as equation 1 and this is equation number 2. Right. Now, apply KVL in this single loop. So, we will get. So, here apply KVL. So, we will get plus V minus Vr minus Vc equal to 0. Then V equal to Vr plus Vc. Now substitute these two equation here. So V equal to Vr I into R plus Vc 1 by C integral of I into dt. Now we have to differentiation on both sides. So that implies dv by dt plus dv by dt equal to R into di divided by dt. So, d by dt and integral get cancelled. Now, the remaining term 1 by c into i. Right. So, here dv by dt 0 that equal to r into di by dt plus 1 by c into i. So, this equation I am writing like this r into di divided by dt plus 1 by c into i equal to 0. Now here in this equation take r as a carbon term. So r into di by dt plus 1 by rc into i equal to 0. So r goes that side. So r into 0 means 0. Then the final equation is di by dt plus 1 by rc into i equal to 0. So, here is the differential equation, right. So, in this equation, p value is 1 by rc and q value is 0, okay. Now, by using this equation, so we have to calculate the current response of rc circuit. After that, voltage drop across the resistor and voltage drop across the capacitor okay so here the total current i equal to so complementary function ic plus particular integral ip so now find out ic here so ic equal to c into e power minus integral of p dt is the equation so now what is p here c into e to the power of minus p so p is nothing but what 1 by rc 
into dt that is equal to c into e to the power of minus 1 by rc into t is the ic value so this is equation 3 equation number 4 okay now what about ip so already we know the ip equation so ip equal to e to the power of minus p dt into integral of q into e to the power of integral of p into dt so here q value is 0 so then total ip value is 0 then current i equal to ic plus ip that is equal to so what is ic here c into e power minus 1 by rct c into e power minus 1 divided by rct plus ip 0 then i equal to c into e power minus 1 divided by rc into t now here we have to calculate the constant c so here for the series rc circuit for the capacitor is act as a short circuit at initially the capacitor is act as a short circuit now we are having the resistor voltage and current so from this constant c is nothing but i that is equal to v divided by r now substitute this c value in this equation so then i equal to so c is v divided by r into e to the power of minus 1 divided by rc into t is nothing but the total current response of the given rc circuit okay so current response of rc circuit is i equal to v by r into e to the power of minus 1 divided by rc t okay now we have to calculate resistor so what is the resistor equation vr is equal to i into r so what is i v by r e power minus 1 by r c t into r so r r get cancelled so we will get v into e power minus 1 divided by r c into t is the vr value the voltage drop across the resistor vr equal to v into e to the power of minus 1 divided by rct and at capacitor c vc equal to 1 by c integral of i dt now substitute i value in this equation 1 by c integral of i v by r into e power minus 1 divided by rct into dt that equal to v by r is constant 1 by c into v by r integral of e to the power of minus 1 by r c into t dt now so v c equal to 1 by c into r by c, uh, v by r so 1 by c into v divided by r into integral of e to the power of minus 1 by r c t is nothing but e power minus 1 by r c divided by minus 1 by r c r c r c get cancelled then v c equal to minus v into e to the power of minus 1 divided by r c t is the voltage drop across the capacitor so here the total current response of rc circuit is i equal to v by r into e power minus 1 by r c t and voltage drop across the resistor v r equal to v into e to the power of minus 1 by r c t and voltage drop across the capacitor is v c equal to minus v e to the power of minus 1 divided by r c t right so now we are having the time constant 
so time constant of so time constant of series rc circuit so time taken to reach 36.7 percentage of its final value we can call it as a time constant where tau equal to rc is the equation so the graphical representation is like this so this is the graphical representation and this is 36.7 percentage so this is the series rc circuit transient analysis of series rc circuit with differential equation okay so thank you one and all